in the previous sessions we have learned the rules and the techniques for reading a execution plan now let's apply those rules and start understanding the execution plan every time you try to understand the execution plan remember these five rules okay i will repeat them one more time an execution plan will contain a root a parent can have one or more children and its id will be less than the child's id a child can have only one parent it is indented to the right in case of many childs it will have the same indentation the first statement is the one that has the most indentation if the two statements appear at the same level of indentation the top statement is executed first keep these rules in mind and now let's read the execution plan let's start with a simple one here i am saying select star from sales history okay and this is the execution plan keeping this rules in mind we have to build the tree okay so obviously zero is our root so always it will be the parent so i have written operation zero and select statement and it has only one child table access full so i have written the table access full that means first the operation one is performed that means it treats the sales history table and gives the values to the operation zero which displays the rows okay in the next session we will examine one more example